After a long day of Oktoberfest madness, we had lunch at a Middle Eastern restaurant along Schwanthalestrasse. That's so hard to say. But anyway, that's one of the things I miss about Germany. Everywhere you go, there's good Middle Eastern food. But yeah, it was raining the whole day and I only got to explore a little bit of the old town. And I also did some shopping. But I would really, really love to go back during the Christmas season when they have the Christmas market so I can, you know, live my Hallmark Christmas movie fantasy, you know? So you remember when I told you about how I became friends with the hotel manager and how she toured my family around the city in my last vlog? Well, I found out that morning that she was going to take us to Salzburg, Austria the next day, which was very spontaneous and I absolutely loved that. She wanted to bring us to the newest branch of their hotel. We have the new logo. And as you can see, she was very excited to show us. <laughs> Each of their hotels have a different aesthetic and concept, and this one was a boho jungle theme. It was giving Tulum vibes, but classy. If you know, you know. <laughs> and we may or may not have done a little photo shoot while we were there. Yeah. Music video. <laughs> Then we went to the Mirabel Palace and Gardens, which is a popular attraction as it was one of the filming locations for the Do Re Mi scene in The Sound of Music. I thought these frosted white plants were fake, but they weren't, and I love how it gave contrast to the reds and the purples. Whoever was the gardener, good job, A+. Plus. When you come to the most expensive hotel to use the bathroom, While you're here, don't forget to buy Mozart Kugel and get the OG one too, which is the dark blue and silver wrapper. Mm, so good. but this pretzel was almost twice the size of my hand. We walked up to the Hohen Salzburg Castle, which is one of the largest fully preserved fortresses in Central Europe. It was built to protect the principality and archbishops from attacks. Where are we? Then we had dinner at an Austrian restaurant to try their traditional dishes. I got their roasted trout filet. That hit the spot. And then I had knuckle, which is a specialty dessert in Salzburg. And it's basically a sweet souffle. Oh my god. It was so light and fluffy. We went back to the hotel and got ready to go out. I don't know why, but I always end up going out the night before the flight home. And I don't know how I do it, but one day it's gonna bite me in the ass. Yeah. 
To, I have no idea where. I think we're going the wrong way. Home. We're going home to the hotel cocoon. And then we're gonna. I think we're. Are we going down this? I'm sweating. Sweating? Yes. So why did you just put your jacket on? I'm so sweaty. I'm okay. I'm just thirsty. I don't even know how many drinks we had. A lot. Ew, that vodka. Ugh. Never mind. Goodbye. Bye. I need to charge my phone. I'm tired, man. It's currently 5.30 in the morning. Holy shit. My trip to Germany was not enough. I will definitely come back. Plus, I have a reason to now that I have a sister here. I can't believe she came to drop us off at the airport. At the Angie, if you're watching this, love you, miss you, and see you soon.